Okay, so my goal is, is you can do two things with these. You could hang them by their feet, or I guess it depends. You can hang them and pluck all their feathers and eat it like a Thanksgiving turkey. <laughs> okay, hell to the no, because as you can see, this is not pumped for, full of hormones, and the turkey breasts aren't, and the legs aren't, okay, this is a wild turkey. So I'm going to go home, and I'm going to grind it with some beef, okay, hamburger. So now... My goal um, is to make a cut in the breast, rip open it, and just cut out um, both of the breast um, meat, breast meat, and that's it. Put it in a plastic bag, call it good, and uh, that's my that's my goal. We'll see what happens. All right, so I'm gonna get this. <laughs> okay, uh, these type of knives right here, they're called um, uh, Havilon. Havilon knives, Havilon, Havilon knives are the best, are basically um, razor blades, okay, so I don't even care about the guts, I'm not going to gut the animal, I'm just going to cut it, rip it, and cut out the breasts, okay, so here we go, get into this baby, actually I might take a few of the feathers off, just so it doesn't get all like, um, in the meat, so I can see what I'm doing here. I don't know if I need to do that. Hell, I'm just winging this bitch. Here we go. I told Corey, Corey that I went to borrow his car and take my two hens to uh, get him, get him, um, get him, uh, to the, uh, get him mounted. He was pissed. <laughs> of course, I was teasing him because first time he shot his his uh, Tom, he ran it right to the. Um, Ran right to the taxer. Anyway, okay, so getting back to this. So I can tell already that um, it's not my first time around a turkey. So here's where the wishbone would be. I have no idea what that's called, but that's the start of the breast. Ooh, it's like squishy. I think I read something about that. All right. Again, I don't give a rip about getting bloody. What I care about is cutting myself with this freaking knife. So here we go. I believe from what I remember, I could have read the, I could have watched the video before I try this, but that's not very fun. Just go ahead and wing it. So you're going to cut from here. This is what my plan is. Oh, shit, that's easy. Look at that. Peels. Now I know there's some sort of a giblet or something right there before the breast meat. See the breast meat there? That's the breast meat right there. I have no idea what this is here. It doesn't look like I want to cut it or eat it, though. It feels like if I pop that, it's going to with nasty stuff. See this? That's good meat right there. So I'm just going to cut this away. So my plan was to rip it open. But, um, man, that's not much meat at all. Oh, jeez. It's like nothing. Wow. Oh, it's still warm. So I wonder if that's where the heart is and shit. You know what? I'm so tempted to cut it open. I might fuck with Corey's turkey, the one I fucked. Let's see what's in here. Yep, that's his stomach. Ah, oh, sweet. Look at that. Oh, man. Why the fuck is stomach way up there? Ah, oh, dude. Check out what it's ate. That's so cool. Look at that. It's like not even not even digested. You got seeds and berries, grass. Dude, it looks like it's just it looks like it's a salad. Where's my fork? Oh look at there's a little worm. Okay, I'm sorry this is I'm sorry if I'm grossing people out. But that's cool. That's so cool. Okay, so like it's <laughs> Why is its stomach by its? I guess I guess that makes sense because this whole neck. I don't know. Mm. Okay, so part one. Why don't you do some research before you open a turkey? That's step one. Step two is check out all the. Look at it's got a little bug. Look at it eats bugs. So technically, turkeys are omnivores. It's got seeds. Dude, it look, oh, look at this grasshopper it chowed. <laughs> That's so cool. 
That is the coolest thing ever. That is so cool. It almost looks like it was stuffed for Thanksgiving, except for the maggots. It's not really a maggot. It's just some sort of a roly-poly worm. Dude, that's so funny. Okay, sorry. I'm going to wipe off my knife. I'm sorry. I got a little... I'm a science teacher as well as a math teacher, so I kind of got geeked out right there. Okay, so... for. And I, I've seen people do head first, feet first. I don't think it matters. I think head first makes sense. So if you hit anything nasty, it falls to the ground, right? Does that make sense? Yeah. So I saw Corey's man crush, Steve Rinelli, do this. And I'm like, what a pain in the ass. I'm never going to do that. And then I decided to cut in the first one, which you've already seen. And I had feathers stuck to my fingers the whole time. So I'm like, hey, you know, maybe I should do it like the expert does it. Probably a smart idea. You didn't look on YouTube or anything on, on really how to do this. Why? Because I can just figure it out myself. Okay. Well, I, I look at that. That doesn't look like breasts. I'm going to grind it with meat, so I don't care what it looks like. See, now that is something that's not good. I know that. If you're going to cook the whole, if you're going to pluck the whole thing, yep. you don't want to rip the skin off. I know he, he did say that, but I'm going to, I'm just going to go for the... I'm just going to go for the um, uh, the breast, and so I don't care if I rip the skin. But you're supposed to keep the skin on if you want to cook it. Okay. <laughs> are you just tired, or are you pissed because of cougar? Oh, stop. I'm just tired. So what are we doing tomorrow? We're going. Oh, by the way, I wanted to let you have your fun over there, but um, a guy heard some shots up here. Yeah. And he, um, it's a property owner, two over, that's watching this guy's property. Okay. And he came up, and I walked over to him, and I said hi to him. I turned the video off because I didn't want him to be freaked out. And he just wanted to make sure no one was shoot, shooting on his buddy's or his neighbor's property. And we started talking. That's why I was gone for a while. Mm -hmm. He started talking. He said because of the hot summer that most deer have got, what was it called, blue tongue or blue, something like that, some sort of fungus, and that... 50, he said he has not seen in the past two years, he has, um, has only seen uh, two spikes. He has not seen any bucks. Any he bucks? Two spikes. Wow. And he said that because of the whatever it's called, blue tongue, blue whatever, um, it has wiped off 50% of the male, of the buck population. It and doesn't do anything to the females? Well, I mean, I mean he just said... Um, and I, I think there's something to what you said is that the farmers shoot the bucks just whenever they want on their land because no one right. can do anything. So um, they're not managing it. So I think we should officially make this. If we decide to do archery, we come back and take a doe. But this is not going to be uh, our. Um, this is not going to be yeah. our deer ground. We have to find. I mean, you know, you got yeah. the you got the uh, most. You got the watering hole. You don't want to say where it is. I mean, he's also probably trying to, you know, push us away too. Maybe. Right. But have you? How many? How many bucks have you seen? You know, we've seen like nothing. Right. Okay, so here we go. So last time I I just had to decide what's. I wanted to look what's in there, and it's a bunch of seeds, and I I think it's like a cows you know has four stomachs yeah so i think they have something where it sets and and then it gets digested so i don't know and i have no idea uh, the best way to cut the um the breasts off so what i was doing actually the second one was actually better because i just like hey i'm gonna do just like a fish but um i'm just i'm planning to grind it now would you like for me to get two breasts for you no you i think you're gonna just grind this baby up do you want any of the meat? No, nah, I don't think so. I mean, there's not enough. Okay. So I thought maybe we could, you know, cook, you know, pan fry one and butter and seasoning and. We and can do a little bit. Why not? Now, do, should we get the heart? No. And you don't want to mix that nasty stuff with. It's not nasty. It literally looks like a salad. It's like fresh. It's not nasty. I'm not mixing it either. As you can tell. How about, you come over here, your cam your camera skills are terrible. I've got it. 
Okay. Um, I believe them. I don't know why he would lie to me. Yeah. He seemed, he, at first he was standoffish, but then we started talking and he was cool. So I don't know why he would lie to me. Because I said, we came here for muzzle loading, and I'm sure uh, Modern Fire must be a nightmare being h up, hugged up against uh, DNR land. He goes, yes. And so I promise we're going to be on it this year. And, I, and he started talking to me. I go, do you deer hunt? He goes, I might, but there, I don't I don't think there's going to be any luck. I mean, yeah, maybe he is, um, maybe he is um, sandbagging, but he didn't seem like it. Oops. I just, okay, so I think I go in like this. So this is the part I have no idea, because I didn't know this thing was here. It's, well, I, mean, I, I want to show it to you. After I cut, after yeah, I get cut the, the meat out. out. Dude, that's a pretty good cut right there. Um, but I don't think you, I don't think you're, you're far enough up. This is the wing. Okay. Right there. You can feel, you can feel the, like, seeds juice, oh, it's juicing out right now. All that good bacteria juice get in the meat. Yeah. You sure you don't want that? The only thing that's kind of nasty is that it is, um... Uh, I mean, you're you're literally not really breasting it out, dude. dude you I, gotta get under there. Okay, do you want to do it? Okay, where's the camera right now? Yeah, I mean, you're just like taking little pieces of meat. Yeah, what, okay, do you want to do it? Would you like to show me how it's yeah, done? Yeah, here. All right, here goes everybody. Right. Corey's gonna show us how it's done. All right, here we go. Get in there. Okay, you just, you're going to poke, you just opened up the, did you open up the, the no, guts? I didn't. I don't think it's the guts. 